Hey YouTube, I want to show you a new microphone that I recently got for myself. It is a uh, Pile Audio PDM, uh, or rather PD Mic 78. Uh, I read on the internet it's supposed to be some kind of knockoff of a uh, very famous mic from another manufacturer. Uh, I'm not going to go into the who that is. We're just going to talk about this mic and, and compare it here in a sec to uh, what you see in front of it, which is an, an AKG D5. That's a uh, uh, meant to be a vocal mic. I'm not really going to go into singing or anything. This is just to kind of show you the price point difference and you know the the sound as you're speaking and the microphone handling noise. Uh, a lot of folks, myself included, when you, when you run sound for people it's cool that you're doing bands and all that but a lot of the times your microphones are uh, used primarily for people speaking, given PowerPoint presentations or uh, you know just generally addressing an audience. They're not really singing. They're not really doing stuff. Uh, so if you're in the sound business, you kind of know what I'm talking about. There's there's a lot of gigs that you get where you're you're not really doing cool stuff like the the band and the lights. You're just you know adding audio for like a conference or something. Anyway, so uh, got this microphone from Pile. Uh, I mean, it was like under fifteen dollars. I don't remember the exact price. I just threw it in my shopping cart because I thought, you know, for fifteen bucks, man, this is like a me uh, going to McDonald's twice so it's very inexpensive apparently it's uh, Chinese made so I guess you're kind of leveraging that uh, the world is flat economy so that uh, you're, you're gaining the advantages of whatever they do in China to make manufacturing a lot less than it used to be in the US and that's a whole nother set of videos so we're not going there anyway so I got this thing for less than 15 bucks I, I really like it for the price that I got I don't you know I don't know if it uh, is one-to-one -one as good as that other manufacturer's microphone but for under 15 bucks man it's great for me so I'm going to show you here the handling noise here for a sec I'm going to take it out of the microphone stand so you can hear me take it out there I'm kind of moving it around moving it across uh, blah 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 so you hear kind of moving around and tapping it so you can hear you can kind of hear the tapping going on there uh, it's uh, definitely got a proximity effect, so as I get closer to it, you hear a lot more of the bass stuff. Uh, coming away from the microphone a little bit, it's, it's not quite so bad, but certainly something that's controllable. It's definitely a cardioid mic, because if you get off access from it, the uh, it doesn't come through anymore. Put it back in the mic stand here. So I, I really like that as far as speech stuff. Now I'm going to swap it out here so you can hear the difference between this and uh AKG D5 and again they're not even in the same price point they're meant for different things this mic is like a $15 mic and I guess you could use it on vocals you could use it on you know mic and guitar amps that kind of thing the AKG D5 which you see right here that is meant for a uh, you know stage microphone it's got uh, a, a really directional pattern it's supposed to really help out with uh, feedback and I can tell you from using it live it is absolutely a great microphone for that kind of thing so again I'm not comparing the two for you to make a choice between them I'm comparing them so you can see the difference between a you know a mic that goes for around about a hundred bucks uh, I guess this is what the uh, AKG D5 you know your mileage may vary you can find it on the internet versus this fifteen dollar microphone I got from from uh, Pile so here we go. I'm going to unplug it a sec and uh, plug in the other one. Okay, so now I got my AKG D5 putting in the mic stand. So you can hear a little handling noise there as so I touched it and uh, put it in the microphone stand. There's a little rumble there. So I'm kind of tapping on the uh, tapping on the mic casing. So you can tell there's a lot less handling noise on this guy. And uh, the output seems to be a little lower, but I think that's because the uh, AKG has a, a built-in foam in the uh, microphone itself. So uh, I can hear a lot more clarity in the upper end. But, uh, you know, just listen to the video and, and uh, see the difference here. So if you're in the market for a couple of uh, relatively inexpensive mics that you just need for general handling, general... Uh, speeches, that kind of thing, you might really want to check out this Pile uh, PD Mic 78. It's uh, very, very inexpensive and, uh, you know, it sounds pretty good to me. Uh, I'll do another video where I mic up a guitar amp uh, cabinet, like sticking it right on the, uh, the speaker so you can see the difference. And uh, I'll get myself uh, some other well-known guitar mics and maybe we can do a little bake-off there and you can see what the difference is. But uh, 
I'm really happy with my $15 purchase. Instead of going to McDonald's twice, I got myself a microphone. It's not a piece of crap. Uh, it, it, it's got some handling noise on it, but for 15 bucks, man, that's a great price point. So uh, you might want to check that out if you're, you're in the uh, market for a, a decent mic that's very inexpensive. You can't afford the $100 for like uh, a lot of standard mics. I think you'll find this PD Mic 78 is uh, pretty good for the price point that you're doing. Later.